Hello, I'm Seth Edens, and this is Ivan Sanabria and Bradley Cook. And today I want to demonstrate for you the progress we've made in the last month on my vision for a virtual pump training maintenance program. Yeah, go ahead, guys, and I'll go ahead and start the demonstration. All right, so if you've seen the previous videos, the first thing you'll notice is an entirely new room. Uh, this room was designed to help the trainee feel like they're in the environment where maintenance on pumps would actually be conducted. Um, within this room, we've added some new features. Um, one of the features, it's pretty neat, is when you grab a tool, if you happen to drop the tool on the floor, it's going to respawn into its previous location, so you're never losing objects. This works for our removable bolts on our pumps. Again, if I drop it, it's going to fall into the pan, so I can have easy access to it put it back in at a later time. Um, for people who are going to be using the product in a smaller physical environment, we've added a teleportability to maneuver around the larger virtual environment and get a full-scale view of the pumps and the environment they'll be working in. So one of the really neat features we've added to this room is the ability to actually drain a physical fluid out of our pump. So if I pull the oil cap, I get a physical fluid draining into the oil can and filling. There we go. Just put it in the pan. Just put the cap back. And now I can actually refill the pump. And I know this is not the correct position, but just to show the fact that I have a fluid I can pour into the pump. There we go. Another feature then is our layered snap tool that we've created and this is so I can disassemble the pump but I can't take off parts without first taking off bolts and the part that is stacked on top of it. So for instance if I take this bolt off, this one, on there, and that one there, now I can remove this piece. Now, as you see, I can't remove this panel until all the bolts are removed. And again, I can show you, I can drop the bolts, and they're going to fall into my pan over here. And now I can remove the final piece. And finally, we have added a, a menu system which I can go back to the main menu, which takes me to just a blank room at this point. But what this room is designed to do is to allow us to load various training scenarios. And we've also included a kind of neat uh, AR feature within our VR. I have an AR pump over my tablet. Uh, it looks a lot better than you get with actual AR. And now I'll go into our schematic view, which may be familiar to some of you. And then within the schematic view, again, I have the pump over here. <clears throat> we still have our teleporting. And then the tablet has a really neat feature now. allows us to scale the tablet and we can leave it floating in space as we separate our pump into our schematic view and now we can actually take part of the pump like this filter and my web browser is going to adjust and show me information about that part so a filter kit for Bush, and I can actually interact with this website. Using a browser, just like you would any other standard browser. When I'm done with the browser, simply press home, takes me back to the menu. Which will pump back up. And back into the menu. So this is the progress we made in the previous month. A lot of new features have been added. I hope this still has your interest. Thank you for watching.